For the past few weeks, I've been receiving so many people asking me to do a Blue Easton Margaret video. Because apparently Blue Easton is bugged, question mark. I haven't really checked it myself. But I've seen multiple videos of Blue Easton with like 40 to 70k attack. Because her passive is apparently uncapped right now. I've only seen global videos. So I can't really confirm if this will work for now. But her passive is of course... For each buff on allies and enemies, she increases her own basic stats by 5% with a cap to 5 times. But it appears that that is bollocks, as my English buddies would say. That it's it's not true. It's it's uncapped right now. We'll try it out. I actually recently, because of the fact that we actually are getting a new Easton coming out did give her uh, attack crit and HP defense so in case the new Easton is either a support unit or a DPS unit I'm prepared uh, I'm actually gonna go on a on a roll here and assume that the new Easton will actually be a really good unit for the bird raid so we'll see but so all right, let's just go. Margaret of HP defense. Not my oh, but, but, uh, it's fine. Not my favorite, but I actually want to uh, just focus the video on Aston. And I want to see how her cars are going to do damage and how her ult will do. Using attack crit for Easton isn't the smartest because Eastons have very low crit chance. But, but her ultimate does have triple crit chance. So the ultimate is really val valuable. The ultimate is triple, right? Not double, it's triple. Yeah, double. No, it's double crit damage. Oh. Oh, that's unfortunate. <laughs> okay. Oh, that changes it. Um, in any case, we're going to be doing this for now. This is with no buffs, so it's just, you know, doesn't even matter all that much, but... Just to get an ultimate gauge out of it, and to... Oh, he quit. she quit asking her. It's good. She, um... Oh, got some space. Very good. Very, very good. We can... If, if you know, Margaret doesn't die, which I don't think she will. If Margaret doesn't die, we can level 3 next turn. That's good. Okay, my enemies are already popping in some buffs. We can already see the stats on Easton. Can I see the stats on Easton? 24k, so that's nothing out of the ordinary. Really. Okay. Let's go now with Margaret's level 3. Invasion, I don't... I gave this very low. Raise up a little bit. Okay. Uh, so long as I don't die here, which I don't think I will, should be fine. Oh, my Margaret would do some absurd damage with <laughs> level 3 Easton plus the level 3s. If I, if I had attack crit. Damn. Okay, waiting for my enemy. Um, yeah, he was also very confused on what to do here, apparently. So... How are the stats looking? Okay. 30k. That's not what I was promised. <laughs> but, well, I'm still gonna buff my Margaret to an absurd amount of damage here, I'm assuming. One shot with HP defense. That's not what I was promised. I'll admit it. It wasn't bad. See, I need to find one of the videos that I've been getting tweeted at. Give me a, a millisecond here. Okay, so this one's from 19 hours ago. Uh, again, I've been receiving so many people asking me to do Easton. So, I've been getting one of these like almost every day. <laughs> and he's using... I'm assuming on global? Let me mute this. But yeah, next turn he shows his stats. Yeah, it's on global. It's taxed in English. No, it can't, it can't be a global only thing, because I was getting this when Margaret was on JP. 
So he can't be a global only thing. And then he shows his stats. Like 66,000 attack. That's... That's not what I'm getting in like 400k HP. That... It's not, that's not what I'm getting though. The, 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 I'm gonna try this on PvE. Maybe on PvE it works. Um, but I was hoping to get this working on PvP. But the, that was like uh, the book stage, I think. The red... I, I would just do the red book stage, give me a second. Well, that was not the book stage, that was the, the Envo stage actually. The boss for the book stage is draw. So I have Margaret level... You know, level 3, I have Max Goffer passive and Easton's blue card. 48,000. Maybe with an addition of... Like... I'm already using attack food. So... I don't know. <laughs> uh, maybe attack buffer in the back? Like, if I had blue Jericho? Okay, for 6 mil. It's not bad. Um, it's definitely not bad. If you're playing, you know, like the the Envo stage, for example, it's actually not a bad way of going about this. I mean, sixty-six thousand. Yeah, if I think if I had, let me put Blue Jericho. So I made the math. Um, her passive is working as intended. So this is me, turn 1, 21.7k attack with Jericho in the back, attack food, and one stack of Gopher passive, not even counting Margaret, um, and the rest of Gopher's passive. By the time that you are getting your maxed out passive, you will have like around 60,000 plus attack. So yes, Blue Easton gets an absurd amount of damage if you build her up and gives like, and like get her passive maxed out, but it's not uncapped. because. That was the whole thing I was I was getting tweets for, is that people were thinking that her passive is just straight up uncapped, when really, they're just giving her so many buffs that, yeah, you're gonna get an absurdly high attack style, of course. Uh, of course you're gonna get an absurdly high attack style. You're using a, you know, her own passive. You're using uh, her own blue card. And... Most of all, you're using the stab buff from um, from Galfer and Margaret as well, which is huge. You can't, you can't deny that. That's just that's just doing a lot for you. So yeah, oh, I got I got what I needed actually. So yeah, uh, she's not bugged in any way. She just she's just being like really properly wor used as intended, and people are just. Um, <laughs> Having a mental breakdown over that, basically. Uh, okay. Well, we're not gonna see the stats next turn, because... Actually, right here. We're gonna take a look at the stats right now. Without Margaret's passive. Without Margaret's buff, I mean. Um, just so you see that her stats are already gonna be insanely high without Margaret's buff. Yeah, 44,000, and then you apply 20% more with Margaret. And then you reach the uh, the number desired. 66, though, is really odd. 66 is really odd. 7.1. It's a little more than with Death Pierce. 66 was really odd. Maybe on Global is a little bugged. Or, um... On that stage, you get a little bit of an attack buff. But, yeah. It's just... Easton be like that. Let me play, you know, since I'm already here. Let's play some, maybe two more PvP matches, just for the fun of it. I want to get her ultimate in PvP. To do a one-shot. Although, you know. You know. I, the, 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 the crit chance is very low. It's very unfortunate. Even with um, her increased crit chance. If we get a level 3, it's not no guaranteeing anything to us. But, still should hit pretty hard regardless. If we get like a level 2 buff. No, 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 attack food. I have changed for attack food, of course. If it had, um, 
Oh, plus I, I don't I didn't maximize my attack with cards either on that stage. I should have. I didn't actually because I usually keep a balance uh, with my cards. But yeah, if you maximize your attack, that that's probably why he had sixty six thousand because he maximizes attack with cards. Easton's not bad though. Like blue Easton is a is a unit that transcends time. <laughs> Maybe this is a little bit of an exaggeration, but it's not a bad unit for sure. All right, ranking up both because both could use the blue card. Plus, you're 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 uh they're getting Margaret's passive building up of her blue cards too. Now they rank up. Let's rank up Margaret. Put on the blue level three. There should be rank up. Thinking here, maybe what we could do is rank up Easton and get her ultimate. He's gonna have to deal with that. He's really focusing on Golfer here. Oh, but now I have to cleanse. Yeah, that's unfortunate. Well, 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 well. Uh, let's hope we're on the level three next turn. I could have got the ultimate if not for. Uh, the the golfer purple card. My marker did so much with it just HP defense there. Damn. Ah, oh, that's beautiful actually. Got the rank up as well. If golfer doesn't die, I don't think he will. Like I said, like I I might not even need like if I. <laughs> Maybe I should just put on Margaret with attack crit just to see how hard she's gonna hit with the Easton buff. But I don't even need attack crit to really hit hard. Okay, so this time here, so let, let's do this, right? We're gonna go for the Easton ultimate. I don't wanna, I don't wanna one shot here for Margaret. But in the same, at the same time here, how much is Easton gonna do with her attack? Oh, wait, she did way more than I was expecting. I mean, she has a super high attack because of the of her passive being maxed out, basically. Oh, I wanted to see like the level three, you know, level three buff plus level three buff, and you know the ult crit everyone. I wanted to see how much damage that would do. But just that one like level that's basically level one card because level two card doesn't add damage, does it? I think it doesn't. I'm, I'm while we search for the next match, I'm, I'm looking her up. I don't think it does. I think it keeps the multiplier. And just adds up the fact that you get one ultimate gauge. No, you get extra 30%. Okay, it's a little more. It hits a little harder than a level 1. But that was basically a level 1. Damn. Yeah, with the, the level 3s. This Eastern team is not bad. It's actually... It's pretty fun seeing the big numbers. Especially from such low... Low... Uh, a lot of Ascan or Margarets we're facing here. This is a bot... See, usually I hate bots, but this wouldn't be the worst, yes, for us to get the ultimate here. I'm wasting the Eastern card, but that's okay. Because I actually really want space. If we could kill Galfer. But we don't have single target cards. <laughs> that's an issue. It's, it's actually not a big deal. It's really not a big deal. I would love for him to not put that much damage reduction there, but that's fine. Now we need is we need to stall a little bit for Galfer's passive. And we're fine. By then we're fine. Just stall a little bit. Do I even need to cleanse this? Should I? Because mm. I, I, again, I do want to stall. I, I'm a little concerned about Ascanor, so I think I will. We're, we're going to stall as much as we can, but... You know, in PvP, stalling isn't really the best thing you can do with a DPS team, right? If you're using a stall team, it's not a name, but <laughs> if you're using a DPS team like this one, it's not the greatest. No, he's getting Gulfers. Gulfers ultimate. Never mind. I guess we're gonna have to end it. Um, that's okay though. Let's see how much damage Easton's level three is gonna do. We're gonna have to end it though. Uh, 
not what I would want to do, but... Alright. <laughs> I know it's a bot, but like, it's still very impressive. This is... How old is Easton, man? How old is Easton? She's like, you know, that... Again, I don't want to say transcends time, but... Lives... He's been living for a long time and has been useful for such a long time. Because, you know... Ever since her release, she's been useful. Like, she's still, she's still useful for Guild Boss. Till this day, she's still useful for Guild Boss. Got her ultimate out, but, you know, not three enemies, just two. 2.6, so if I had another enemy, you can add under 1.3, basically. That was type neutral as well. Let's do, listen, I, let's do the math here, okay? Let's do the math. So, she did 1.3, right? I, I can't show the calculator. Let me show the calculator, all right? <laughs> let's do this real quick. Um, yes. She did 1.3 million. I, I'm not gonna counting the other numbers because I didn't pay attention. 1.3 million. Should have been a dot there. Okay. It's fine. 1.3 million. It's gonna be better. 1.3 million. And then times 1.3 if it was type advantage. Times 3. That would have been 5 million type advantage. You know, on three red enemies. Now, red enemies are not the most popular enemies you're gonna find, except, you know, may maybe Bond. But it, numbers exist. 